Hello everybody on YouTube, how are you guys today? Well, I want to talk to you guys about more about cable filters and cable amplifiers for your digital uh, TVs and also cable boxes and stuff like that. But what's the difference of these two different devices? One is a filter, it helps to filter out some noise in the cable line and your main cable line itself. Or your antenna line itself, if you'd prefer to use antennas, that's uh, your choice as well. I can also use this for my radio, the amplifier, and the filter. And the amplifier helps to boost and amplify the signal uh, for your cable as well. That's what's kind of cool about these two different devices. They almost do the exact same. But one is a filter you put on the end of your uh, cable line and you put on your end of your uh, boost or of your amplifier and that would actually help to clear up some of the pixelation. Now, it only pretends what type of cable you are using from the cable company. It only pretends on how thick the cable line is. Now, with the cheap or uh, Colex cable, it's like, say, this one, hell. This is a cheap one. This one is just a very short one. It's about only a couple of feet long, not that long. Say about three or four, like one foot long. This only helps to connect uh, two different devices together. But what happens, you guys can see, this is a very old style uh, crimp one uh, cable connector. This is what happens when you get moisture or rain. Uh, down the cable line itself, you uh, can code the shield or the uh, little uh, copper cable right here, your signal wire right there. This is a very small piece of cable, you guys can see. This is not going to be used for anything. This is just a demonstration for you guys to understand on what's going on with this type of uh, cable. Now, typically, if you want it, you can put a uh, heat shrink or uh, electrical tape around the uh, old style uh, connectors and help to keep moisture out. But what's kind of neat is the event that these guys, these are called water resistant rubberized uh, caps. You put on the ends of your uh, filter or the ends, the tops of your uh, thing, your, your amplifier. It's kind of cool. But this hill is a cable amp, uh, filter hill. You guys can see your main line goes here and it filters this way. And this connects to whatever uh, amplifier you choose to actual use uh, for uh, your cable itself. This will work best for antennas and also probably work a lot better for uh, cable as well. But it's kind of cool. So it's kind of unique. I looked it up and it's like, yeah, it's just a filter. That's all it is. It's just a main uh, cable filter. It helps to keep noise out of your uh, uh, TVs and stack and stuff. But typically, you disconnect one of these things. Uh, you probably will go back to all that stack and noise uh, in your uh, cable as well. This hill is a amplifier. This is actually a pretty good amplifier. You guys can see it's a very uh, heavy duty. You guys can see this is made for outdoor use. So you guys can see it has two mounting screws and plus it has a grounding screw to actual ground us to the earth as well. This is your power input uh, 15 DC and your RF input. This is where your uh, antenna or your cable line can go here. And your output is right here. Now typically, if you have multiple TVs, you're gonna have to use multiple splittles because this one's only a one connection output. You guys can see, that's all that is. And by the way, I have these little caps on there to actually protect the ends of the shreds and also keeping the dirt and dust out of the ends of the whole of the main uh, signal line going on the outside. Now, uh, typically this will be on the, on the outside of the house, but not on the inside. And what's kind of cool, you guys can see right here, it has like a little, uh, little OD light that tells you it's actually powered, and that little uh, just tells you that. But it's earth ground. But you guys can see, uh, this is made in Michigan, I guess. That's what that little sticker says, and that's pretty cool. And if you want to actually seal this up a little bit better, 
you can use a outside uh, cable box like one of those plastic boxes or if you want you can put a bead of silicone all the way around the uh, metal uh, chassis now this cannot be opened uh, it does have four screws where you can try to take it apart but don't try to take it apart it will not actually work it won't come apart because the company who made this you guys can see it's right up there it is well sealed and well made uh, for outdoor use now uh, for old old style uh, TVs uh, typically older style TVs may not even have cable connectors it may have those little screw terminals on the pack and this is a very neat uh, device I really understand how this actually works it helps to produce the signal or amplify the signal for your cable TVs now with multiple TVs like we have in this whole entire house uh, this is only typically meant for one TV and one cable box not for any own TV that's the biggest problem because it will be like a signal drop and a uh, issue with the amplifier not working properly the way it actually should now this here you can screw this on the, the RF input right up here you guys can see if you take this little cap off and I go and remove the little rubberized boot and if you take the uh, filter and you just screw it on the end like here and this will actually help to reduce the uh, noise or the uh, coming in uh, issue from your main cable line itself that's what's kind of cool now if you are going to be putting this outside please make sure you actually have like a rubberized uh, boot to actually cover the uh, input and uh, output of your device all three of these have to have those little uh, rubberized boots now this is just a protective cap these caps do come off these is just what's on here when you actually buy this uh, do I know another thing else but I had this for a very long time and it works pretty good I tested it out on my TVs and I also tested it out on uh, my radio that's kinda cool guys can take a look at this if you want here's the, the name and here's the uh, actual model number of uh, this unit it's just a standard uh, filter I thought it was kinda cool very interesting of uh, cable and how cable works together with each other and also if you do have a dish you can do the exact same thing or if you have a satellite and also uh, antennas you can do the exact same thing by using this and also the uh, cable amplifier as well to help to boost some of your uh, signal needs and uh, filtering you need on your system alright guys this is about it with this stuff here I don't know a whole lot about this but I will search it up and see what's all how this all works it's kind of cool alright guys if you are all been on any of this channel please hit that subscribe button leave a comment down below please like please share uh, thank you for watching today's vlog I will see you in the next one laters peace out guys